Second John. Second John teaches us that we are to walk in love. That's the message of the Apostle John as we come to the second of three letters that he writes, first, second, and third John. Walking in love. That's a theme that Jesus spoke about in the upper room with the apostles. He said to the apostles, the night that he shared together in Passover, the night he was betrayed. Jesus taught. He washed the disciples' feet, you remember. He broke bread with them, saying, do this in remembrance of me. Jesus taught the disciples, they will know that you are Christians by your love. John was at that Passover meal, and years later, he would pin the second letter called Second John. He speaks to us about walking in love. He teaches us in his letter that we are to give mercy and to give grace to other people. And when we do, we release peace in their hearts and in their lives and also in our lives. Remember what Jesus said. They will know that you are my disciples by your love. I'm in Yuba City this morning preparing for a morning walk, a hike up the Sutter Buttes. I was invited this past week to join about 15 other hikers from Northern California. I'm very excited. But as I make my way up to the trailhead, I come by and I see all of these blossoms on these trees. Can you see them? How do you know it's spring? Because it's on the calendar. How do you know it's spring? Because the weatherman said it was. You know it's spring because the blossom is upon the tree. Spring is happening right now. Jesus said, they will know that you are my disciples <laughs> by your blossom, by that sweet fragrance of the smell of spring. That's right. Spring has a smell to it. I wish somehow I could let you smell these beautiful blossoms, they're all over. This whole field, this whole region is covered with trees that are starting to blossom. How about in your life? Is there a fragrance of love, of mercy, of grace? Are you releasing peace wherever you go? That's the manifestation right there, showing other people God's love in your heart and your life. Last night, I. I saw Kelsey Grammer, who played Chuck Smith in the movie, Jesus Revolution. He was talking about playing Chuck, and he began to weep and cry. Oh, he saw the love of Jesus in Chuck, Chuck Smith. How about you? If someone played you in a movie, would they be playing a role showing mercy and grace and peace? They will know that you are my disciples by your love. Father, I thank you for the love of God in our hearts and our lives. I thank you, Lord Jesus, for how you change us and fill us with your mercy and grace. We walk in mercy, grace, and peace that others might experience your love. Let the world know that we are Christians by our love. In Jesus' name, you be blessed today as you walk with Jesus, as you walk in love.